This one's for consistency. And because it's for consistency, I have one video to catch up on the day down. Uh, the topic of the day is going to be consistent. But the question is, what are you consistent about? For me, it's my schedule. Six mornings a week, I'm up at 3.30 a.m. Day starts with clean water, then my favorite protein and full-fat yogurt. I make my first coffee of the day. Yes, I believe that coffee is good for us. Everything in moderation. At 4 a.m., I've loaded my papers, I'm checking the changes to my route, and I drive alone in silence for over an hour. After delivering to about 90 customers, I stop at a nice forested trail that leads down to a beautiful reflection pond. I do a round of Buddhist mantra in Sanskrit, that's 100 time, and 8 times around the prayer beads. Um, then I set the day's intention. Example would be today. I intend to feel confident in all my actions, which is a good thing because I have a meeting in an hour here at noon uh, with a bunch of my friends where we get together and we share how our week's gone and what we've learned and what's working for us. So if that appeals to you, you can get a hold of me. But otherwise, it's 7.30 in the morning, I've finished my papers. Well, it's my mundane deliveries to 200 plus happy customers, or at least 99.5%. I probably miss... Uh, place a paper once every day or two, so I mean, I don't know, most businesses, if you had less than half a percent or a quarter percent error rate, uh, they'd be ecstatic, so I think all my customers should be happy. Um, at that point in my day, I've already consistently done between 45 and 4,600 steps. Um, funny story, I get paid to exercise, that's what the paper is all about, that's one of the health changes I made. Um, I picked, you know, three and a half years ago when I was recovering, to go and do jobs that had physical labor as part of their the necessity of completing the task, and for me, it's a timed adventure, so the object of the game is to drive less, walk more, and still get it done in less time. So when I get home from doing newspapers, I have my second package of made cal because uh, science says that 20 to 40 minutes after exercising, there's a golden window of opportunity. If you don't believe me, just go check it out and Google for yourself. Um, I take my four basic supplements, the two pills for my heart, and uh, make Angela's two packs of immune cal at the same time. At this point in the day, we have raisins, craisins, and for me, chocolate chips. She's not a big fan of them. Uh, I like a few, a couple ounces, maybe, maybe an ounce and a half. Um, I spend an hour with the love of my life. Uh, she gets in for her route just before me, four out of six mornings a week. Fridays and Saturdays, uh, I finish early, and I get to make an extra post or catch up on some of my commenting uh, requirements in the ABCs of blogging. So quick shout out there to Chris Saus. Who has helped me with the ABCs of blogging and she keeps us up with the placards and she makes sure everybody's doing their commenting responsibilities and that we're all behaving like adults. That's pretty hard since most of us are adult children. It must be for her like running a daycare. <laughs> but uh, Chris is wise. Um, she knows how to handle the young ch children and, and take care of bringing everybody in. So thank you Chris for your efforts. Um, that's it for today. That's Michael Pierce talking about consistency. Uh, have an awesome day. And uh, the other big thing I like to shout out about is one of the reasons I work from home is three days a week. So um, Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday, I am available at 2 o'clock in the afternoon to show up at the elementary school where my grandson's in full-time kindergarten. And I get to pick him up at 2.30 and bring him home. Uh, that is so cool. And it's one of the benefits of working for yourself. So that's Michael Pierce signing off. Uh, like, comment, and share this. Uh, have a great day.